Hey there guys, it's Kai, I'm here. This is Q&A number 30. There are 45 questions for this q and I'm gonna go get started and answer them for you guys. All right, uh, let's get on to those questions. Here they are. The first question is, did you enjoy the Pokemon Go community that had featured Totodile? Absolutely. But for an hour, uh, I didn't get a shiny Totodile, but an hour and nine minutes later of the event, I ended up getting one. And of course, I went back home and ate lunch, and then got back uh, with Community Day and got four more shiny Totodiles, along with the first one I got. So yeah, it was a it was a okay community day. It was pretty good, but the worst one I ever did was probably Beldum because it was it was the longest way for me to get my first ever shiny Beldum. So yeah. the second question is, why do we get YouTube trolls all the time? I don't even know. I'm getting really sick of it. The third question is, did Doug Dumero finally review the Mercedes-Benz CLS 450? Oh, yes he did. It's in the description below. Go check it out. I love the Mercedes-Benz CLS class. It's a gorgeous sports sedan. Like, you know Mercedes calls it a four-door coupe. The next question is, what other compact SUV did Doug Dumero re review? The Toyota RAV4. It's in the description below. The next question is, did Doug DeMiro ever review the new BMW 8 Series? Yes, he did. It's in the description below. There's a review. The next question is, did Doug DeMiro ever review the BMW X5? Yes. Yes, he did. It's in the description below. The next question is, how many shiny Toto dials did, did you catch during the Toto community day? Five total, like I told you. The next question is, have you ever ate at Taco Bell? No, I'm not really a Mexican food kind of guy. I don't eat tacos or stuff like that. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm kind of a picky eater. The next question is, are you still doing that uh, trade with the person that has your shiny Santa hat Pikachu? Uh, yes, I am. Uh, but we're still working things out. He's not giving the shiny Pikachu to anybody else but me. That's what he told me. The next question is, what shiny Pokemon do you predict you will encounter next? I will have to say Aaron, because that is a because that is a shiny. I really want so bad. The next question is, uh, when do you leave for Cleveland, Ohio? Uh, February 3rd, but I won't be back until February 7th. The next question is, where do you shiny check Pokemon every community day? In my neighborhood. Just like literally everywhere. <laughs> in my neighborhood. The next question is, what other pickup truck did Doug DeMiro review? The new Ford Ranger. It's in the description below. The next question is, where did you catch your shiny Caterpie? Well, that's a really good question, by the way. It's, it's a street that's like super close to my house. It was just like right there, less than a minute. Uh, uh, from my house. So, yeah. The next question is, did Doug DeMiro ever review the, the Bugatti Veyron? Yes, he did. It's in the description below. The next question is, did Doug DeMiro ever review the Ferrari F430 Spider? Yes, he did. The review is in the description below. The next question is, what shiny Pokemon are you going to hunt for in Cleveland, Ohio? Yeah, um, let's see. I already got shiny Caterpie, so I'm looking for shiny Shelter, shiny Whelmer, uh, shiny Krabby, uh, uh, shiny Magikarp, 
shiny Sableye, shiny Shuffet, shiny, uh, uh, well, there's a bunch. <laughs> um, maybe another shiny Pikachu if I actually encounter one in the wild. Uh, who knows? Just, it depends on my luckiness. Uh, the next question is, what other car from Bentley did Doug DeMere review? Uh, the Bentley Azure is a 2007 model. It's in the description below. The next question is, have you, have you played Pokemon Let's Go in a while? No, I haven't. I really gotta play that game again. The next question is, do you still play Super Mario Odyssey? Yes, I do. The next question is, how many baby Pokemon do you have? Oh, there was, there's a bunch. There's a bunch of baby Pokemon I got. And I got a few Pichus, a shiny Why Not, uh, a regular Why Not, a, a Magabee, um, a Togepi. Yeah, there's a bunch I have. Uh, the next question is, was there anybody hating Andy Phoenix? Yeah, there was. And I even hated her uh, when she was a troll, but I'm glad she's no longer a troll. She's a good user now. The next question is, did Doug DeMere ever review the Aston Martin DBS Super Legera? Yes, he did. It's in the description below. The next question is, did Doug DeMere ever review the Lexus LFA? Yes, in the description below, there's a review. The next question is, what other car from from Volvo did Doug DeMere review? The Volvo XC40. It's in the description below. The next question is, did Doug DeMere ever review one more Chevy Corvette? Yes, he did. It's in the description below. It's an old Corvette, but, but you'll still see it in the description. The next question is, where are you going on Tuesday with your mom to go Pokemon hunting? Well, there's a shopping center that pretty much every Pokemon trainer in San Antonio loves to go to. It's the Cory. Uh, I never got a shiny from the Cory, but I know a lot of people have. Uh, like during the Halloween event, I was looking for shiny Witch Hat Pikachu and shiny Drifloon, but I didn't get any luck. But I ended up getting shiny Duskull. But not at, but not at the Cory. I got shiny Duskull uh, here in my neighborhood, so. The next question is, where are you going to meet the person that is going to give you a shiny Santa hat Pikachu? I'm going to meet this person at an HB. He wanted uh, me to meet him there, so that way he could give me the shiny Pikachu and I could give him the shiny that he's looking for. The next question is, did Doug DeMere ever review another actor at NSX? Yes, he did. It's in the description below. The next question is, what other Mercedes-Benz Black Series did Doug DeMere review? Well, it's the Mercedes-Benz CLK 63 Black Series. I think that's what it is. It's in the description below. The next question is, what was your first shiny Pokemon of 2018? A shiny Pikachu. What was your first shiny Pokemon of 2019? A shiny Totodile. The next question is, did Aston Martin ever made a sedan? Yes, he, yes, Aston Martin did. Uh, it's the 1987 Aston Martin Laganda. Aston Martin already had a a sedan, it's the Rapid S, but, but back then it had the uh, Laganda from 1987. I'll put the review in the description below so you guys can go check it out. The next question is, in your opinion, what car from BMW do you think looks weird? The BMW Z1. It's in the description below. There's, uh, Doug reviewed it. The next question is, in your opinion, what is the worst car from BMW? The BMW Isetta. <laughs> it's in the description below, uh, and it's really ugly. The next question is, in your opinion, 
What is the ugliest car from Toyota? The Toyota MR2 Spider. There's a review in the description below. The next question is, what other car from Cadillac? Doug DeMiro reviewed. The 1977 Cadillac Eldorado Berets. It's in the description below. The next question is, are you, are you going to try to get a shiny Phoebus during the Pokemon Go research day? <laughs> I am definitely trying to get a shiny Phoebus. The next question is, what shiny Pokemon did you catch that were not in your neighborhood? Uh, a shiny Squirtle, a shiny Rosalia, a shiny Drowsy, a shiny Nalatu. Uh, I hatched the shiny one. Uh, uh, let's see. Uh, shiny Monum. I think those are the ones I can think of right now. I think of right now. All right. The next question is, what is your favorite Alolan Pokemon? The Alolan Raichu. I really want the shiny Alolan Raichu. I don't have the normal Alolan Raichu yet. The next question is, do you transfer shiny Pokemon? No, not at all. I don't transfer any shiny Pokemon. The next question is, what car made by Acura was stolen all the time? The Acura Integra Type R. There's a review in the description below. The next question is, how did your family do when they did Q&A videos with you? They did amazing, really amazing. How many raids have you done so far on Pokemon Go? Way too many to count. Um, <laughs> and the final question is, do you think Ash Hat Pikachu should come back on Pokemon Go? Absolutely. Because I only have one Ash Hat Pikachu. And hopefully, if they do, they'll probably come up with shiny Ash Hat Pikachu. I hope they do come back sometime. Because that was an awesome Pikachu event. And the only Ash Hat Pikachu I have is a female. Well, which is not bad. At least I have one Ash Hat Pikachu. Well, guys, that's all the questions for this Q&A. The next Q&A is January 21st. So don't forget to send me questions in the comments below so that way I can answer them for you guys for next week's Q&A. Alright guys, subscribe to my channel, drop a like on this video if you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys next time on the next video. Bye-bye.